Um, you, you said a few years ago that you'd like to have three kids in your life. I mean, are these still yeah, of ambitions? Are these still, you know, does marriage and relationships still, still hold the same place in your life and heart as they did? Of course, uh, time frames change. Uh, because I remember when I started, I said I'm going to get married at 28 and have kids by 30 and all of that. So that changes, but the ambition and the desire are the same. You know, I want to get married, I want to have children. Uh, and I'll do it in the right way, you know, meet a like-minded person, fall uh, madly, deeply, truly in love uh, and take it from there, you know, everything should be natural and organic. Yeah. You know, um, when you were asked recently by GQ magazine, you actually didn't deny that you were dating Arya, but you said it's really new right now. What do you like when you're in love? Are you a different person? Are you a better person? I think every human being does extraordinary things only when they're in love. Um, uh, so yeah, I, I, I believe that uh, love is something which, um, which is a privilege, you know, if it comes in your life. Um, and to be in a happy, beautiful, positive place, uh, a relationship with could it could be with the girl or guy with a friend your mother your father anybody but when there is some genuine love it is really beautiful you know you, you know my girlfriend alia is a bit of a overachiever and she probably took every class there is uh, you know from guitar to screenwriting and i always i always feel like a underachiever next to her I mean, the first time um, we did an interview, I think it was 13 years ago, before your first movie came out even, I remember you saying that I want to be married by 32 and have kids by 34. I think that was the, that was the original plan. Now you missed that deadline. Was it? Uh, yeah, yeah, I think... I think by, by six years. By six years or something. Now again, these are not things that one can really plan to the T, but are you closer to achieving that goal? Well, I think, I would, I think it would have already been sealed if the pandemic had not hit uh, uh, our lives. Uh, but but I don't want to jinx it by saying anything, you know. I I, uh, I, I want to kind of pick mark that goal very soon in my life. But yeah, I have to say that in terms of Ranbir and his uh, planning, he is like he totally blew my mind away because A, I was not expecting it because we weren't even talking about it. We were talking about it for a very long time, but then there was so many pandemic delay. Ye, wo were like, chalo, now we won't talk about it. We'll just go with feeling. And that's exactly what he did. He didn't tell anyone. He just carried the ring and he did it in the most amazing place because it's a place that we both have such a strong connection with, which is Masai Mara. Um, and in the middle of the jungle. And it, I, it was just amazing. Like, I don't think I could have ever pictured the way it worked out together. And after it was over, what I didn't expect was that he had planted our guide to take the pictures also. So mm. after everything was over, I was still dealing with the shock and I was like so emotional and he was like, he took pictures and I was like, you he managed knows how to much take pictures, pictures into me. I was like, what are you saying? And I saw those pictures and of course, it was like, it was too, it was too special. Merry Christmas. Yes, Paparazzi debut. 